everybody, this is Kathy. Happy Sunday. Welcome back to my channel, Kathy's Favorite Things. Happy, happy Sunday, you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I hope you had a great day today. It's past dinner time, so you're probably getting ready to go to bed and finishing up your day. And I am here with a big Dollar Tree haul that I wanna show you so I can put away as well. So um, let's just start with the snacks. I have some things here that are snack. Um, I got this for my family. It's the snack pack chocolate. Uh, it's like chocolate pudding. Yeah, chocolate pudding. There you go. And it says it has less than one gram of protein, so it's not too good for you. And it's 100 calories per serving, but this is for my uh, my husband and my son, so they they can eat it. I try to stay away from like too much, you know, snacks with a lot of calories, let's say that. Okay, and I also got the butterscotch one. This one, same brand, it's gluten-free. If you guys, you know, watch the gluten and stuff like that. Something that I was super excited to find is this um, Healthy Living. I think it's the brand for this. It says produced in the USA um, and it's organic almond milk. There you go. And I got two of this for my oldest son. He drinks almond milk when he makes his shakes when he goes to the gym. So I got that for him, uh, two of those. And they expire on March of 2021. So that was a great find, I think. I also got some of this snacks. It's um, Sneaky D, I think that's the brand. And it's cheddar baked fries. And this expires also on 2021. So we have, you know, a few more months to eat it. I got this ginger snaps. I've never tried this. And this also expires in May of 2021. So another snack, you know, when you have teenage kids, they're always looking for something to eat. So this one is another one. Good Health is the brand. And it's uh, baked cheese puff mac and cheese. See, it even looks like mac and cheese so that's another snack and I got this one CGI Fridays potato skins and jalapeno cheddar for my husband he loves those you know some snack that he can take to work also this one is the same potato skins cheddar and bacon it's also for my husband and this uh, brownie I love when I can find the brownie there because this usually at the supermarket is over two dollars but at dollar tree it's a dollar for the duncan Hines, which is just uh, you know a name brand so i got two of those and so we're gonna be baking with augustine probably this week and i got augustine this lip pops this is the halloween edition look at that with the uh, dracula teeth and look at those green lips so i cannot wait to open this let's see let's open and see which one we get let me see if I can. Let me see if I can open it. Just to see which one we have here. Okay, so they're tiny. See, we have the Dracula teeth right there. So you can see that. And we have four. Um, the other one is just, you know, just some white teeth. Those ones. More. Uh, Dracula teeth and the green lips. Look at those. Okay. So those are the four we got. Super excited. He's going to love those. And do I have any more snacks here? I think that's it. So let me just put this in the kitchen quickly and I'll be right back. Hold on. Okay, you guys. I also found some cleaning supplies. This Lysol uh, lavender smell. This is for the bathroom. So that's awesome. I got two of those. I got a couple of the Dawn um, dishwashing liquid soap and I think I got two packages of napkins and two packages of the paper towel. It's the mega size and you can cut this the size you want. I think you can make it either small or larger if you want. So that's the cleaning stuff that I got oh, and some hand soaps. And this is a new one I've never seen before, the Suave Juicy Orange. And I got three of this liquid hand soap uh, because I was running low on hand soap. And you guys, you never want to be without hand soap now with this 
pandemic times we're living in, right? Okay, something else for like the bathroom. And this is for my son. He loves uh, face masks. And this is hydrating cream mask. It says Manuka Honey Collagen. And this is the uh, Freeman brand, which is, you know, a name brand. So this is for him. He's probably going to end up using that. I also got him some. He's like an old man. He likes bar soap. On top of the shower gel he uses, he always wants bar soap. And this one is Irish Spring uh, Charcoal. Um, there are two bars in here. Really good deal for a dollar, so I got that for him. Um, I also got him the Jartley London Activated Charcoal. He has had this one before as well. So I got those two for him. Something that I found, I don't really do a lot of uh, fake eyelashes. I used to do a lot of eyelash extension before. Um, and just one day I decided to stop because I was paying like $100 every time I, I used to go there. And they didn't last that long. They were falling off. Like the same night that I had them done, I would the next morning wake up with them on my pillow. So... Um, now I only put fake eyelashes if I have to go to a party or something like that. And, you know, and lately I don't go anywhere. So besides grocery shopping, <laughs> but I did find some like fake eyelashes from Dollar Tree last time I, I went, I think. And I'm going to try to put them on one of these days. And this is the same brand, the Ioni or whatever you say. And I don't know how to pronounce that. Ioni, I think it is. It says Everlasting Lash Glue. And this is that one. And I really like the iridescence on the liquid in there. I think that's what caught my eye, really. The iridescence, because I'm obsessed with iridescent stuff. And it says 100% vegan right there. And it's not tested on animals. So, um, yeah. I decided to give this a try. So, usually when I do use false eyelashes... I have a glue that I buy off of Amazon and I think it's, what's the brand? It's a name brand. I think it's L'Oreal or something. I don't remember. Um, I always buy it from Amazon and it's black. It's like a black eyeliner and then you put your, your eyelashes in. So, but I will give that a try with this eyelashes from Dollar Tree and see if it works and I will let you know. Okay. Or maybe I'll put them on with you and you'll see if it works or not. We can do that. Yeah. Probably. Okay. So something else that I bought uh, for like personal use is this toothbrush. It's uh, charcoal infused. This is also for my oldest son. Uh, it says adult size, one piece. Does it say where it's made? In China, made in China. And I also got the dental floss with this. It's probably around here somewhere. I'll show it to you when I find it. This had me super, super, super excited. You will not believe this. I have some washi tape that I use for my crafting, but I do not have like a lot of washi tape. Because, you know, at the beginning I was buying a lot of washi, but then I wasn't using it, so I stopped buying it. So anyway, I saw this and I could not resist to grab it because look at that. See those roller skates over there and see the gumball machine and the Pac-Man. Oh my goodness. And look at the camera. It's amazing. And it has gummy bears. Look at that. And the cassette tape. Can you guys see that? OMG. I saw that and I about fainted. I'm so excited about this. I will be using that in my happy mail, you know, in my cards and stuff like that. It's so pretty. And they only had one and I was looking and looking and looking and I could not find another one because I really wanted to get more to send like in happy mail, but they didn't have any more. Got this thing uh, for my son Augustine. It's one of those Legos um, base plates where you can, you know, when you're building like houses or buildings or whatever you put this on top of this base and we do have one from like the real lego stuff um but sometimes we want a bigger one so we got a blue one now the other one we have is green the one from lego and for my crafting you guys if you missed my video from this morning 
for the uh, down the rabbit hole collab make sure you go check it out I'm gonna link down below I also have another collab this week it was on Friday it was a Halloween collab I'm also gonna link it down below for you to go check it out in case you missed it okay and because I will be having a giveaway at the end of both collabs with some things so make sure you comment on all those videos and watch them and comment at the end and make sure to subscribe because I will be having, like I said, for both of those collabs at the end when I'm done with both of them, I will be having a giveaway, okay? And this is a foam mounting tape and I buy this for my crafting. This is that sticky stuff that you use to pop up your um, ephemera pieces. And this is really, really sticky. It's from the Super Glue brand and it's awesome. I love that one. Um, this DIY ornament, look at this, there are two in here for Christmas, I know, I'm still doing Halloween crafting and I'm not going to start Christmas crafting yet, probably, but you know, you need to grab this as soon as you see it, because then it's going to fly off the shelves, so again, DIY ornament, there are two pieces, two for one dollar, it's a really, really good price, and I got two of those, I only got two because I'm gonna probably be using that to you know like put stuff inside and send it in like happy mail because I have a bunch when I say a bunch is a bunch of ornaments there are glass ornaments though that I bought last year from like the uh, four dollar grab bags from Michaels and I I know that I'm gonna be using some of those for like altering and stuff like that and I'm gonna try to send some in happy mail for people to alter but I don't know if they're gonna make it intact because they're glass so that's the thing you know that's what has me a little bit worried this was something that it really made me happy when I found it it says makeup and brush drying rack and this is new I haven't seen it before it says eliminates clutter and hold brushes while drying so when you wash them you know you can put them here like that like so you can also use them to put like your um crafting brushes there and hold them uh you know the ones that you use for like distressing and for distress oxide and stuff like that so you can use that for like in your crafting or for your makeup brushes and i got two of this um because i thought it was a really really good find uh something else that i found um was this envelopes and I was out of little ones and sometimes I want to send well I'm gonna try to send flat mail to friends you know like a memdex or maybe a card something flat that you can maybe send from your home with a couple of stamps I am not really successful at doing that because usually I like to make stuff that is chunky and I cannot do that, but I'm gonna try, try, try my best to be able to do flat mail, or maybe send a few of like die cuts and stuff like that for people to put together. So I needed this little, little envelopes and eight for a dollar is a really good find. So I decided to grab one of those. This thing, the pink, oh look, it goes with my shirt. The pink and silver is so pretty for like packaging. And you can use this year round. I can use this for Christmas. You guys, I bought some um, pink paper for Christmas crafting. So I'm like, I need to grab a bunch of this for Christmas. So I got a couple of those. And this is a repurchase from last year. If you saw videos from me uh, from like last year, when I did like crafting, Halloween crafting and stuff, I wore this same um, headband. And Augustine broke it for me, my uh, youngest son, so I had to rebuy it because I really, really like it. And I bought this ice cream truck. And these are those uh, cutout pieces where you can, you know, I like to use this in like when I send a package or something, if I don't have a card and I like to send a quick note, then I like this kind of things. And Augustine and I, and my husband too, we all love ice cream in this household. And the ice cream truck, Mr. Dingling love it so yeah I had to have it first time I see that at the store and I did have some that my dear friend Tony from creative chica halls crafts if you don't know Tony go check her out she sent me some of this and I used it all so when I saw it I'm like oh, more Mr. Dingling so I had to get it 
I found myself this ribbon. Look at this beautiful stuff. Let me show you up close. Can you see that? Look, it's iridescent. One is white, the other one is like black, and the other one is purple, or like a magenta or hot pink. I don't really know what color it is, but it's pretty. So this one um, looks like a thick ribbon with like glitter on it, and the glitter is um, iridescent. So, oh, and it's thicker. Oh, it's a thicker ribbon. Holy moly, that's awesome. Look at that, okay. Can you see that? So that's sticky and look how thick that is can you see that it's thick and it's super shiny look so pretty okay so that's awesome and they only have these three colors so I got one of each because really I don't really need a lot of ribbon I have plenty you guys I have plenty of ribbon to do crafting with so I'm like, I just couldn't resist those because it's only five foot. It's not a lot, okay? It's not nine foot like they usually do. Their uh, ribbons at Dollar Tree, they're usually nine foot, but this one is only five. But I think it's because it's like a specialty one that it's holographic and it's also a sticker. So that's probably why it's less. Um, I get this for like Happy Mail for like Halloween crafting. I'm working on some Halloween crafts for some friends, for two specific friends that I'm crafting for Halloween. One is like pastel Halloween and the other one is traditional Halloween. <laughs> so, um, you know, when I send their packages, I'm going to include some of this witch's hat in there. And I got two of them because they are so cute. I can resist them. And I know I'm all over the place and I have Christmas and Halloween mixed up, but you know, like I said at the beginning, when you see something at Dollar Tree, you need to grab it right away or you will not find it next time. And you will be like, oh my goodness, why didn't I get it? You know? So that's what I do now. Usually at the beginning, you know, when I start hauling at Dollar Tree, I'm like, oh, I'm not going to get it next time I'll get it. But then next time I go and look for the stuff and it's no longer there. So I'm like, not anymore. I learned my lesson. I finally get the orange coffin. I hold the purple one twice thinking that I didn't have it, but I did have it and I needed the orange one. So I got the orange one, super cool. It says trick or treat right there. Look at that. Look at those spooky eyes. And you can definitely use this to put like candy inside and send it in happy mail. So cool, I love it. And this one is a new one that I hadn't seen before. I did not have this one. Look at that one, it says rest in peace. And look at those spider webs all around it. Look at that. And you open it and it has something also on the inside. It's a mummy, look at that. <laughs> it's a green mummy, so cool. So I did not have this one either, so I did get it. And the purple one I have twice, but I think I'm sending those in front mail. I did see this ghost and I really, really like it. Last year I got the witch and I think I still have it. I'm going to find it. I didn't get it because I'm like, I'm pretty sure that I still have it. But if I don't, then I'll get it next time. They have plenty. I did like the ghost this time better and it says something. It talks. So let me see. It just lights up and says trick or treat. It's motion activated. So if you put it outside and you have like kids coming to get treats, then this thing is going to sense the people coming and it's going to say trick or treat. <laughs> I don't think anybody's coming though trick or treating this year. And in the neighborhood that I live in, we don't have any little kids. It's only grown ups. Augustine is the only little one and he's not going to go anywhere to get treats. I'm going to buy plenty of chocolate for him to have here. <laughs> and Trick or treat, smell my feet. Give me something good to eat. That's funny. That's so funny. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Um, I know I'm all over the place. I already said that, but look at this cute gnomes. Look at this. It's from, you know, Dollar Tree, the Christmas stuff. And look at the back. It's pretty well made, actually. 
what caught my attention when I saw these gnomes is that they are really well made for like a Dollar Tree ornament. And this is like a felt material and look at the arms and look at the beard on the nose. They do need a little TLC though. I mean, knowing me, I know that I'm going to be adding some stuff to this gnome before I give it to someone. Probably this is going to get a touch up of something. So I got two of them and this is probably going to go in like, you know, if I do like a pocket letter or something, maybe this is going to go in like a happy mail. They're super light and I really, really like them. They're red. I'm going to be doing a lot of pastel Christmas this year as well as last year, but I know that I will still do some traditional for people that like traditional. So I will use that. And I found this thing and I grabbed one. And it says Merry Christmas and it has the red barn and it says um, it has the dew twine here and it has some glitter some some like snow glittery snow over there I did like this the snow globe it was super pretty the shape of it but I know that this is going to get altered this is not going to look like this I'm not gonna keep it like this I'm gonna you know change it up so I love that Got myself another of the little trees because I know that I will be doing some shadow boxes and stuff like that for Christmas. And this is going to come in handy. And I did get one package last time, but I wanted to get another one just in case. So I don't want to be running out and say, oh, you know, I should have gotten two. So yeah, that's why. Got this for Augustine. It's a Frankenstein hopping toy. Those are the one that you wind up here and they kind of jump. Super funny. I got myself some glue. This is the beacon glue. Super, super good. It smells a little toxic though. It's, you know, it says in the back, extremely flammable. So make sure you are not using this near your stove or your near a candle or anything. You know, watch out for that. But it's a really, really good glue. So um, I do like to have, you know, some glue handy when I'm crafting. Sometimes I need different kinds of glues. So this for a dollar a dollar tree and it has only 51 mls so but it's good i have another one that i'm still using but i didn't want to run out tacky glue tacky glue oh my goodness i love tacky glue especially when you're working with like wooden pieces tacky glue it's so fast drying and it sticks like right away like I got those tiny, tiny cubes from Dollar Tree that I put together for like my son Augustine. And I used tacky glue to glue that together and that thing never fell apart. And he's been playing with that and it's still together. And I used tacky glue. So yeah, for a dollar and this is uh, three fluid ounces, 88 mLs. Really, really good buy from Dollar Tree, you guys. More Christmas stuff, it's a Christmas tree. Look at this one it's different it has tiny holes in it and there are five pieces in here these are ornaments they're uh, color your own ornaments but you can use this for so many other things you can use this in pocket letters in mem decks in like atc cards in your bag toppers anything you want so yeah why not right super pretty um i did get some of this um autumn mix like candy corn with the pumpkins this is not for me i do not like this candy not at all i got two bags of this i don't know where the other one is but this is for happy meal it's gonna go to someone that loves that i do love chocolate any kind of chocolate if you want to send me candy send me chocolate or gummies or sour gummies that's it nothing else <laughs> uh no those things i don't like Okay, look at this. This is new. It's a glitter stick and see how she has it on her face. So I think this is for like when you're doing your makeup, if you want to go out to like a Halloween party or whatever, you know, but this is look how shiny it is. It's gold. I'm like, oh, I need to have that. Even if you, you know, you can even put it on like your hair because she has some on her hair. And when I do like makeup try on, we can try this on. Maybe I can put it on my lips and see how it looks because why not it says face and body you can put it everywhere you want see that over there they had this in red green purple but i like the gold because gold is one of my favorite colors yes so i have to have it 
I got some more glue sticks because you can never have enough glue sticks, especially if you're crafting <coughs> crafting 20 pieces. Make sure you grab the ones that say 20 pieces because some of them are 16 pieces. So get your money's worth. And I found this. This was super, super fun. My dear friend Patty from Life with Patty, she recently sent me some winnings. Um, and she did send me some glue sticks that were shiny. Um, but this time I found just the gold ones at Dollar Tree. And this is from Crafter Square. So you can see it's super, super shiny. There are only 15 in here. So I was super happy to find those. More of the Color Your Own ornaments from Crafter Squares. This is five pieces and it says Mary. And I don't know if you can see the uh, deer head right there. So yeah, this was also a fun find. And another Christmas one is this ribbon that says Believe. You know, for like uh, your letter to Santa or whatever, you can use this. And this one is nine feet. See what I was telling you about earlier? Uh, usually Dollar Tree is nine feet, but this one, again, it was only five. But yeah, this one is the red one that says Believe. And I found the dental floss that I said it was charcoal infused. Uh, it says 16.4 yards, 15 meters of dental floss. And the container is black also, which I like. It's kind of modern looking. You know, changes from the white one that we usually buy at the supermarket or at the pharmacy. I got another one of the mesh. This one is with the snowflake and blue. And I will be doing Winter Wonderland also. So last my last haul, I had haul one of this. And I did get another one just in case. Uh, because, you know, I always, I don't want to be without it. And I know that I will not find it in another week. I did see this tiara and it's a light up tiara. Look at this. I don't know where the thing is to turn it on. Probably includes batteries. Um, I think it does include like a tiny battery in there. Does it say here? Use non-replaceable. Yeah, so it comes with batteries and they're non-replaceable. So this is pretty much a done deal. You use it, you break it, it goes in the garbage. For a dollar, I'm fine with it. Look how pretty that is. They had it in clear and in pink, I think, or purple. I did get the clear one. I like that one better. And this is probably going to go in Happy Mail. Super fun. Uh, you guys know that I love baggies. Like any kind of baggies, I'm obsessed with packaging. I saw this cat and I thought of my friend Melissa and G-Cat. They love kitties. And you know, a lot of people love kitties too. And for like uh, my Halloween crafting, if I want to send goodies, I can use this. And I love the eyes. Look at those eyes. Super fun. Okay, this is something new uh, that I had not seen before at my Dollar Tree. And it's like a picture frame. And it says, it's the little things in life. And I really like it. It has like a piece of acetate in between. And this is like a plastic frame. It looks like a wooden piece, but it's not. It's plastic. And, you know, I'm probably going to alter this and turn it into something else. Like a DIY kind of thing. So, yeah. I got myself more nail polish. Those are the colors that I usually like. You know, I those two colors I like a lot. Yellow I like too, but you know, now we're into the fall colors, so I will be doing like more reds or oranges. But I do like the uh, pastel colors, so I'm excited. Three for a dollar, perfect. This had me super excited, and I know it's tape and it shouldn't be so exciting, but this is a brand name. It's Tape It Multi-Purpose Film Tape. It's 60 yards and it's a red tape. And when you send packages, you know, uh, you need duct tape or any kind of tape. And for just a little bit of duct tape, it's a dollar. And this is a big, fat roll of red tape. And it was one dollar. And it was tape, this, this is a brand name, Tape It. And I got it in red for Christmas. And I got it in orange for Halloween. Yeah, you guessed it, Halloween. Look at that, multi-purpose film tape. Tape It is the brand. And I did not look it up on Google, but I'm pretty sure that this is more than a dollar at some other places. I found the other autumn mix that I'm going to send away. I got this um, tea light candles. I have some um, 
tea light holders from last year that I got at Dollar Tree that they were uh, Halloween related. So I needed some more of this. It says 240 total hours. And it's the brand is Luminescence. I don't know the color. Are these black maybe? The flame. I'm not sure if the flame is black or white. Let's find out. Okay. Let's find out. Why not? Oh no, it's yellow. See? Okay. I thought it was maybe darker or like blue or something like that, but it's yellow. So you guys know. And it includes batteries, so that's a good find. They also have them in orange, but I wanted the black ones instead. Oh, I got this uh, flower. It's a Drew Barrymore brand flower. You can find this at Walmart usually. That's the color LS24 and it says Berry Bloom. Berry Bloom. It's like a burgundy color. Super cool. I will be trying this out tomorrow in a video, so make sure you come back. Um, found this for Augustine. He was with me that day when I went to Dollar Tree and he wanted the sticky eyes. And he throw this on the wall and then, oh, it's messy, but he liked that stuff. So I'm like, fine, whatever. He got himself this masks. This is Hulk. He also got Batman. Daddy loves Batman. So <laughs> he says this is for daddy. That's for him. And we got, I think it was Captain America before. So... He's now getting a few of them. I found this lonely uh, jot organizer case. And I do love this thing to put like, you know, beads or whatever, trinkets. So I saw it lonely there and was calling my name. So I'm like, okay, I'll find it. I'll buy it. Because, you know, if I don't use it for myself, then I'll have it for like an embellishment box or something like that. Oh, by the way, don't forget my birthday challenge starts well, it kind of already started because I've been receiving entries. Um, but it officially starts at the end of September because I wanted to give people a break, you know, and like there are a lot of challenges out there. So I'm like, officially starts at the end of September. But if you want to start sending things ahead of time, you can do that. Um, I have received two entries already and I know that one more is on the way. Uh, so yeah, and I will be having two winners and each of them is going to be $50 so yeah but I will talk to you about that again in another video but I just wanted to give you a reminder okay uh look at this cute spider <laughs> with the skinny legs Augustine wanted this thing so I got it for him and it's just decor I don't know what he's gonna do with that but he liked it look at this beautiful tin can it says hello fall with the pumpkins and I think I'm gonna send this in happy mail Probably it's with like chocolate or something in there. Look how pretty it is. So hello fall. And this was one of my favorite finds. And it's this. Look at that triangle thing. And it's super, super cool. And I got it in these two colors. And this one is smaller, I think. Is it? No, they're the same size. But how beautiful they are. This is for like... um shadow box and i love the colors in the back actually i love this color more than the lavender one but i like both so i will be using those to alter probably and do a diy with those we will see i will think about it and i'll show you of course when i make it and i got myself this trinket tray thing trinket box actually is the name i love that the top is gold and see those colors are like pink and yellow and blue super cool and i always need trinket boxes to you know put my jewelry and stuff in there when i you know doing something so i think that's it for now you guys oh no wait i forgot something i forgot this cup i have this cup it says blessed and it has a bike and it has like the fall colors and it's like the tiffany blue super pretty uh, I will be giving this away, okay, you guys? So if you want it, make sure you comment down below, hashtag blessed, and you will be entered in the giveaway for this uh, video because last um, haul that I did, it was a live, and I forgot to say, okay, this is what we're going to do for the secret giveaway this time. And then I'm like, I didn't want to do it separately. So yeah, this time I'm going to be having this, hashtag blessed if you want this uh, Tumblr 
and it's super pretty look at that again it has the bike and the flowers super fall colors if you like coffee or tea or whatever or just water just make sure you comment down below make sure you are subscribed and do hashtag bless and you will be entered in the secret giveaway okay you guys that's it for now thank you so much for tuning in for coming to visit me i will see you again tomorrow with a makeup try on video i will have this and some other makeup that i have some from Dollar Tree and some is not from Dollar Tree. So it's going to be just a mix match of uh, makeup that I have that I have not used yet. So make sure to come back tomorrow, okay? And we will do that. Thank you so much for watching again. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I love you guys. Bye now. Don't forget to check out the links down below. Bye.